stick flowers out of here, out of Jared, you know. I'm on thin ice, man. The judge is not really happy with me right now, you know. So, apparently Eddie's got a car for me. He said he's going to pull it around, so. Once he pulls it around, we're, we're out of this joint. A few moments later. Yeah. Alrighty, so I got my car back. And I haven't seen this since I came back from New York, man. Really don't care. I mean, I like it. Yeah, this is the last car I had when that cop put the double juice in there. Uh, Eddie got it back for me. But the um, license plate kind of sucks because it's got my, my bars that put in there. I miss that bar sometimes. But, you know, just gotta stop at these stop signs in there because, you know, I'm so close to losing my license, the judge said, you know. And I'm thin ice. It's fucking bullshit. And I even tried explaining to the judge that that cop was running and he said he had his lights on. I said, that's not fair. I said, I wish I had lights. He said, oh, you see me a cop? I said, no, this ain't a cop. That. I just don't want to run back into that one out here again. Give her a wash first. Eventually. I just noticed something. Why does my plate have a... He's a fucking ignition bro. There we go. Rock it on up. Shut her up. See if anyone's here, man. Is anyone here, man? I'm here to get some more beer, man. Just gonna lay the money on the counter, man. Drink a beer. Drink a beer. Yeah, yeah. Nice and refreshing. Sons of anarchy. 
but it was pretty good tonight. Meanwhile. Hey, are you part of this fine uh, group that owns this this uh this bar? Nah, man. I just came here uh, to get a beer, and it's pretty quiet here tonight. Ah, uh, gotcha, gotcha. Yeah, normally there's people here on the weekends, but I'm surprised it's dead right now. Uh, understandable. All right, I was just uh looking to talk, talk some business. Uh, yeah, yeah. I don't know if I see them, I let them know two gentlemen step by. All right. I don't know what they're looking for business for. A few moments later. Yeah. I don't know what those guys are asking me about. About if I knew the people that own this place. I don't fucking know the people that own this place. I want to fucking get rid of the people that own this place. Get them out of town, man. <laughs> Talk about how badass they are, man. Put your panties up in your bitch and, you know, tuck your little sticks and turn them into tacos and, you know, you can't fucking protect me, although they were talking, oh, we'll protect this guy, you guys are gonna take him out, you guys, you guys can take him out, yeah, I'm gonna put my panties on real quick and I'm gonna shove this uh, stick and turn it into a taco real quick and maybe a little kitty cat, you know, that's all they were, they were bitch. I need to better back it on him and me and Dickie are running back in the chair. Later that night. Yeah, that's a unlucky guy. This about are you for real? And he's gonna park over there, just walk over here. Look what's going on, man? Like I don't know. What It's going good, man. Is that, is that Mickey? Hey, what's going on, man? It's Mickey, man. Oh my God, Mickey! It's been so long. Ah, I, did, I was here yesterday. I was not. How have you been, Mickey? No, oh, I've been good. How have you been, man? I've been all right. How's Chicago treating you? You know, the mayor over there. Yeah, being the mayor over there, I've been building up this. It, it's been. I built it up a lot, man. It looks pretty amazing out there. That's awesome, man. Well, can I get your uh, your registration and insurance really quick? Yeah, sure. Then let me go back in my car and grab it for you, man. All right. There you go, man. Mickey Flowers, man. All right, thank you. thanks, Mickey. I'll be right back with you. All right. Hey, man. Tell me, he just asked for my information. To be honest with you, I just gave it to him. I mean, he yeah. was, was actually saying he hasn't seen me in a while, and uh, he welcomed me back, or whatever. I said, I'm welcome him back because I've been here for a while. Yeah, where's the van at? Oh, the van. Uh, well, uh, after what happened, uh, the other incident, and it, it's gone. They, uh, apparently, when I went to jail and whatnot, 
after that last cop because uh, allegedly the last cop he gave me warnings and then after giving me warnings he pulled me over and then he instead of giving me a ticket he was going to take me to jail so you know i went to jail for that whatnot but i went to court you call me well I, I went to court and i fought it and because you know the jail i mean the judge told me that the cops should have never done that so but he basically said with my record he told me that i'm on thin ice and if i get you know caught doing dumb stuff again i could lose my license but i had to pay some fines so i got out you know, but I should have called you because he gave me warnings, and then after like two or three warnings, he didn't even give me a ticket. He said that he's just arresting me. All right, let me talk to this guy because I, it, what did he get? I think he got you for headlights, so I'll talk to him and we'll see what we're gonna do about it. Because I prefer this up on your record. You, you got All too right. much on there already. All right, yeah, these headlights came like that when I bought the car. Were they on or just not working at all? Yeah, I don't know. I could turn them on. Let's see if they're working. Oh, yeah, there you go. Did you get them for headlights, or...? Yeah. Alright, uh, are you giving me a ticket or warning? Uh, I, I just gotta give a fix-up ticket. Mickey, are you, are you senior or junior? I'm senior. Junior's my son, but Dickie killed him. I, well, this car is registered to him, actually. Yeah, it used to be his car, and now it's my car. Okay. So, I'm not gonna be writing, uh, writing you an actual citation. I'm just gonna go write a fix-up ticket really quick. Just wanted to double check that, you know, Mickey Jr. knew you had his car, but I didn't know he was dead, so. Yep, they, Dickie he killed him. Away. Oh, well, what's happening with you and Dickie? Oh, no, well, it was back in the day because my son, you know, he's one of those kids that, you know, mess around and find out type deal. Every time me and Dickie got in trouble, he was going around snitching to the cops and telling us to look, well, telling the cops the location of us and whatnot. Allegedly, Dickie didn't like that, so then. Dickie went, oh, wow. So Dickie went to go kill my son, but then around the time, I killed my wife because back in Wisconsin, before I moved out here, she threw me off a bridge and almost killed me, and she had a gun threatening me. Yeah, yeah, I remember all that. Yeah, so so then I took care of her, and then he took care of my son, so now I'm just back <laughs> to being a single person again, and it feels better because I don't got no one to worry about, no one snitching on me. Yep, and That's is, valid. he's a helpful man. Yes, he yeah, is. I'm Give me one second, I'll finish writing up this fixed ticket, yeah. and then I'll, I'll get you out of here, alright? Alright. Yeah, well, I'm trying to better myself now, that's why I'm trying to help you guys out, you know? Yeah, thank you. It's just they haven't been there. I've been going back, but they haven't been there. Yeah, I got you here. Hey, uh, what's up? Uh, you still around town? Do you have one? Right over with him? Because he goes to the party now. That's why I was looking for him earlier, because I lost eyes on him real quick, and that's why I asked for a quick Oh, well, that's interesting. That's a surprise. What do you mean? Mickey being an informant. <laughs> SOA's going down one way or another. Don't say Fair anything. enough. Alright, Mickey. I'm gonna head back and around patrol, but thank you. Alright, have a good one, man. Alright, see you right <laughs> He's with Wallaby. He said he lost me for a minute. I don't know if he was stalked by him, but I'm gonna get server now because I'm uh, I'm going to agree I gotta, I can't be breaking the laws. Although the last time, you know. I should have, I should have asked for him. I, I know who his name is. I'm not going to stitch it out and tell the other cops that. Who it is, but you know. I should, I should have said, I want, I want to speak to officer, blah, blah, blah. Or trooper, or deputy, or whatever he is right now. This is a mark, so. But, uh, I went to jail for it, and, you know, uh, I, went, I went to court, I paid my fines, you know, it was, it was running some stops, I don't know. But, eh, just, I'll get this fix it ticket. I mean, Ed, I, I forgot this is my son's car, you know. <laughs> He's like... Are you a junior or senior? I would say I'm a senior. I mean, if they look at my sins ID, it's a picture from Dead for some reason. I don't know why the DMV would put that on the ID, a picture from Dead. Blood everywhere. That's, that's messed up, man. <laughs> he said, like, how's Chicago for you, Joe? The Chicago treat you pretty well, man. <laughs> yeah, this is still my home for now. This is still my nephew. Yeah, Chicago, I bet you didn't know how much you had to do it up there. Yeah, I was treating you well, you know. Still good. Alright, Mickey. Yeah. Um, 
Just gonna just gonna hand you this. It's just a fix a ticket, so you're not gonna be cited for anything. You're not gonna have fine or nothing. Um, it's just giving you two weeks to go ahead and change the the color of your headlights before another officer can actually cite you for that. All right. Yeah, all right, man. Yeah. Uh, what's wrong with the headlights? This is my son's car. I mean, I barely ever drive this thing. So yellow, like yellow colored headlights are actually legal, or any colored headlights in, are actually legal in the state. So just as long as they're white. Um, or, or like a uh, uh, a white LED light. That's that's what's legal. Yeah, all right. Yeah, I don't know yeah. where my son got this from, but it, it's been sitting in storage, and I just pulled it out since my van's been crushed. I don't got a van no more, man. Yeah, I mean it should be easy as enough as is to whether it's just the tint in front of the glass to just take the tint off or just change out the bulbs. Yeah, I'd probably so. in the morning when the shop opens, just go see what what, yep. what the damage is gonna be. Yeah, well, you have a good one, Mickey. I'm just going to hand you this, so if any officer stops you for the uh, the color of the lights, you just hand them this and let them know. Yeah, yeah, for sure, man. All right, you have a good one. Yeah, have a good one, man. They don't look illegal at me. Unless he's talking about the bottom portion of it. But I think that's how it comes. I don't know, man. It's not my car. It's a You know. I don't know why he had a car like this. Because I had a car like this back in the, the days of New York. Tomorrow for sure. Can I get a coat, please? Oh, yeah, that's it. Oh, you don't? Oh, darn it. Okay. Hey, I just walked out with a video. Hey man. Hey. What's going on, man? Hey, did you pay for that? Yeah, I paid for that. 
You paid for it? You got your receipt? No, I don't take receipts for alcohol. Uh, yeah, they're supposed to give you a receipt if you paid for it. I, uh, I tell them to throw it away. I don't like receipts. Alright, well, when did you pay for it? Earlier. You didn't Earlier see, you, 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 when? You, so you're, you're... You didn't see me put the money now? Uh, no, I did not. The clerk said you didn't pay for it. Allegedly. I paid for it. Do you happen... I mean, I didn't see him pay for it. He did pay for it. <laughs> okay, so you, you said that you put money down on the counter, but... Oh. He didn't give you a receipt. You told him to throw it away. Yep. Okay. Was he at the counter when you when this happened? Uh, yeah. I mean, it looked like him, unless it was someone else. But I threw it down, and I said, here you go. And he said, you want the receipt? I said, no, nah, keep the change. And I just walked out. All right. Well, uh, I'm sure they've got cameras here, so we can take a look at the cameras real quick, and we can get it settled. This dump, this dump doesn't got no cameras. You got cameras, man? Alright. You wouldn't happen to have an ID on you, would you? I mean, yeah, I do, but what's it to you? Well, right now we're investigating something. Are you... Is this alcohol? That's what it appears to be. Yeah, it's alcohol. Okay, so you're drinking alcohol in public at a liquor store. Well, technically, I live in my car, so I'm about to be home. And then I'm going to stay there for the night while I'm parked. Okay, but you're consuming an alcoholic beverage openly in Alle front of a liquor store. Allegedly. I'm looking at the alcoholic container, and you yeah, actively drinking it. No, no, I haven't got nothing in my hand no more. Okay, threw it down. You didn't throw it away. And what's it to you? That's littering. Eh, littering, littering, who cares? All right, man. So that's two things here. Um, you got your license on you? I'm gonna need to see it. Yeah, sure. I'll give you my license. Here you go. It's a Dicky Cheese. Okay. Uh, can I physically see it? Physically? No. Mentally, you can, because I don't got it on me. Okay. And your name is what again? Dicky Cheese. Uh huh. You, you want to try that again? I just told you my name. That's my name. Go look it up. You'll find me. Can you uh, spell it for me? D-I-C-K-Y-C-H-E-E-Z. Okay. Hold on. <laughs> That's not me. I'll just lie. <laughs> I'm not trying to get Nicky tra trapped up there, that you know. I just want to see. Cause I, I so want from to see, uh, see looking at our CCTV, the guy didn't pay. Okay. Yeah, that thing's yeah. a lie. Could have been someone else. That wasn't me. Maybe this bar place anyway. She never came here. <laughs> I mean, I'll go inside the pay, I got no problem. <laughs> Alright, man. Um, sir, did you check the, uh, the cameras? Yeah, uh, and it, he didn't pay. He did not pay for it. Okay. That yeah, could have been anyone, man. That wasn't me and the cameras. Prove it. All right, man. Why don't we stuff over here in front of this Tahoe real quick, okay? Come on, man. Do we gotta? 
Yeah, let's step over here real quick. You don't quick. need all these cops here. You guys, you guys are scaring me, man. Yeah. Come on, let's let's step over here real quick, and we'll talk away from these other people and get some business taken care of, okay? Yeah, let's step over here, man. All right, go ahead and turn around and place your hands behind your back for me. Hey, no, I'm not going to jail, am I? Right now, you're being detained, okay? Come on, I can go inside and pay for that. Well, right now I'm gonna detain you. So if you'll turn around and put your hands behind your yeah, back. Yeah, come on, man. Yeah, just hassling me, man. All right. Um. So, I'm not sure if you're aware, but you have a couple warrants that you haven't gotten taken care of. Warrants? There's no way I have warrants for my arrest. I just All recently right. got out of jail, so that makes no sense. That means I'm looking at five. Yeah, that makes no sense. I should have no warrants. That means the last 10, 15 times I've been pulled over, I should have went to jail. I don't got no warrants for my arrest. All right, well, we'll figure that out. Also, I spoke with the owner of the business, and you did end up uh, not paying for that alcoholic beverage, okay? Well, you I, also I, threw I, it I, down I, on the ground. I can go inside and, and pay you for were, it. You were consuming it in public. You dropped it on the ground, which is littering, in front of a liquor store. Well, I, I could take care of my trash and go pay for it. Okay, well, you didn't pay for it, so well, that, that was I, I the original. Have. Okay, well, now it's a little late. That's like robbing a bank and then returning the money and saying I'm I, sorry. I would never do that. That'd be dumb. I would agree with you. But, I mean, over a bottle of beer? Come on, it's just a bottle of beer. Well, we'll get all that taken care of, all right? I'm going to go ahead and put them in my car. You go ahead and let me out that back door over there and just let me go. No, I can't do that, man. Yeah, you can. I'll just pay for the beer and leave. And uh, I'll never come hey, back. Alright, before I put you in here, I have to search you. Is anything on your person I need to know about? Guns, knives, drugs, anything? Maybe. You have to find out. Search when you find out. Okay, I'm asking you. Well, just to be I'm honest telling you to search. Well, I'm, I'm going to, so. You want to hassle me? I'll hassle you. You find out. Okay, thank you for the help. Hey, get your hands off my money, man. It's for the beer. I'm not gonna, I'm not, I'm not gonna touch your money. I'm gonna put your money back in your pocket, okay? Hey, it's for the beer I was gonna buy. All right. So before I put you in the car, I gotta read you your rights. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be held against you in a court of law. You have the right to an attorney. If you cannot afford one, one will be appointed to you. You understand the rights as I've read them to you? Yeah, yeah, I understand the rights. Okay, with those in mind, do you wish can be speaking with me, or do you want a lawyer? I don't mind speaking with you. I just want to go pay my stuff and get out of here, man. All right. So do you want me to take the money that's in your pocket and pay for the beer? Yeah, you can pay for the beer. You can tell them to keep the change, too. There's like 10 bucks in there. I'm pretty sure that's enough for one beer. Okay. <laughs> I just want to see. I saw it open. I was like, you know, fuck it. We're going to see like a round <laughs> I saw people over there and I said, fuck it. <laughs> I'll pay for it though. I, I'll give, I'll let them keep the change. I just don't want to go to the AI litter. I, I drug in public, I guess. Uh, I'm sorry. <laughs> All right, man. He wants, he wants to pay for the beer. Um, he said it's a $10 bill. He said you can keep the change. I was going to ask you, do you want him trespass from here for stealing? Okay. I couldn't hear him, but I think I'm trespassed. Alright. It's hard to hear, but I think, yeah, I think I'm trespassed. Right. He's got some other stuff he's got to get taken care of, so he'll be out of your hair for tonight. Ah, uh, yeah, I'm going to jail. Alright. Fuck. You too. Yeah, he's got a couple warrants that need to be taken care of. What's his name? Uh, Dick Cheese. Huh? <laughs> okay. Or Dicky Cheese. I don't think I've ran into Jam before, so. It was written, written up by, uh... <laughs> they think I'm Dickie Cheese. By, uh, Morin. Okay. Alrighty. All right. I appreciate All right. it. Look, he's going out here, man. I ain't got no fucking lunch for my arrest. 
Might be my brother though. I'm not the EG. Okay. They're not getting me for those awards. Fuck off. Uh, I just said that. The picture does not look like him, and I just realized that. He didn't give me a physical ID. I'm not going to jail for his shit. Clothing pretty much matches. That's, that's all on him, bro. Uh, Ow! My neck! Ow! Oh, my, my I don't even know. Ow, oh my, my god, bro. I, I swear, bro. I did not even see. I could not see your car. My neck. Ow. Bro, I, I cannot Ow. even see your car, bro. I want to press charges. Ow. Let me back up. Ow, my neck. Ow. Why do you have to Check hit? on your detainee. Ow. Why do you have to hit Mickey hey, Flowers? Man. Are you okay? Uh, no, he just hit me, ID. man. man Alright. Anything hurting? Uh, just my neck a little. I think it's just a little whiplash. Why do you hit the car, man? Uh, I don't, I don't know, man. Um, come on, man. You can't hit the car. Second. Mickey Flowers is in here, man. Wait, right, right, right here, guy. Hold on, uh, man. You said your name was Dicky Cheese. Uh, well, yeah, yeah I, I, about that. That's my brother. My name's Mickey Flowers, man. I, I just, I don't, I don't want to go to jail, man. So you're telling me now you've lied about your name? Yeah, I'm sorry, man. I just I got scared and you guys came up to me. I just don't want to go to jail, but my neck kind of hurts. I want to press charges against this guy. Man, come on, it was an accident. No, no, I'm pressing charges. I'm having a bad day. Hold on a second. <laughs> yeah, arrest that man. Put that man in cuffs, arrest him. Hey, bud, your name's not coming back. Oh, let's move away from here real quick. Yeah, it's not coming back. Yeah. Okay, so you've given me a fictitious name. So your name is not Dickie Cheese. Your name is... My name's Mickey Flowers, man. Okay. Let me run that name. Yeah, I don't got no words for running that name. So, don't know what my brother's been doing out there, the but you guys better American find him man. and catch him if he's being a criminal. We're driving this black Subaru. He literally turned into Deputy's car, who has a detainee in the back right now. Um, uh, my neck hurts. Just ran his name, Jason Mogwood. Mogwood. It did not come back to anything. He's saying that it should, but I'm not getting anything if you can try to run it. He's giving you guys a fake ID like you gave me, probably. Uh. <laughs> Alright, so you do realize that giving me a fake name is illegal, correct? I know, man. I just got scared, man. You guys came running towards me, and then... It, 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 but you don't have any warrants. I told and you. you gave me the name... That's why when you said warrant, like, I ain't getting no warrants from my arrest. Yeah, he's got No, but your brother does. Well, whatever he's doing, you guys better find him. He shouldn't be doing that, man. No, but you shouldn't be giving fake names no. either. Yeah, I'm sorry about I, that. I just got, I got scared, man. You know, you guys got I just triggered. You got Betsy in there. I was gonna walk out one beer. It's just one beer, man. And you guys came. I just got scared, you know. Okay, hold on. <laughs> just traffic in general. Like we don't have traffic. This on fucking right new now. cop thought it was actually Nicky. I ain't going to jail for his fucking shit. Hell no. He did that. Fuck. And this cop is probably going to arrest me too, but the cop, see, that's the thing. You got to look at the ID. A, like, you got to make sure you're talking to the person because, you know, I can look like that person, but there could be something different about it. Because me and Dickie, right. you put us both together. We, our faces definitely don't look the same. Well, we also left. I'm going to run I got longer on hair. Super, see if it comes back to He's got tattoos. Mickey doesn't got tattoos. I thought about back in the day giving Mickey tattoos, but I figured, no, I'm a stoner hippie. And, nah, I'm... I mean, if I was a hippie in today's age of, you know, society, yeah, I'd be all tatted up, you know, probably piercings in my ears and the whole, the big holes in my ears, you know, and piercings in my and all that, you know, just, you know, one of those punk, like, new age hippie guys, you know, from what, what most of the hippies I see around here is just, they smoke their weed, they got all their fucking piercings in, all the fucking black emo shit, even though technically it's emo, but, you know, they're 
they, they and add me to everything that's done either. with this. I mean, probably not, but still. But, I ain't gonna okay. get over Nicky shit though. I can, I can, I, can, I know I'll see that. I'll my deputy called. Hold on a second. Hold on. Hey, does he need medical? Let me double check with him. I don't think so. And uh, then I got a question I gotta ask you. Hang on, let me go ask right. him. Hey man, do you need any medical attention or you feel a little bit better? Yeah, I mean, my neck is just a little sore. I think I'll be fine though, but send that guy to jail, man. Alright, so you're just, you, you think you're okay? Yeah, I think I'm okay, but I want to press uh, charges. Okay. He says he's fine, but he wants to press charges on the guy that hit the car. Yeah, he he, he <laughs> flew away. Oh, okay. Um, so this guy gave me a fake name. Oh, he no gave way, me his though. brother's name. Um, I'm trying to find what, because I was going to issue him a citation for that. No, um, that's, that's arrestable. 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 Okay. That's what yeah. I figured. I was just going to try to downgrade it. Because um, that, that's false identification. <laughs> all right. Yeah, I've got him for failure to identify right now. That works. Um, yeah, and then yeah. littering. <laughs> Well, yeah. he, he has how many warrants again? Oh, no, no, okay, so the name he originally gave me, it was his brother, and he had four warrants, or six warrants. This guy doesn't have any. Six him. warrants, bro. Jesus. Why dickhead. is he trying to take his brother's warrants? That's what I, he, now when I told him he had warrants, that's when he was like, oh, no, that's not me, that's not me. So did, did his DMV photo come back with, to him? No, when he the DMV photo time. is different. The second when time, you, yes, yes. The second time it is. All right, so slap him with the figure to identify and obstruction and then book him. <laughs> All right. Fuck. He wants to try to do that and then, no. <laughs> Fuck. State guy's going to run, write up your accident report, All right. I would take him for transport, but I don't have a cage. All right, yeah, I'll take him. All right. Um, make sure okay. you clear with the trooper over there. Make sure he has everything he needs on for both ends, <laughs> and then if he does, you're good to go. All right, appreciate right. it. Hey man, you need anything else from me? <laughs> I call him a fucking. You need anything else from me? Just give him a second. <laughs> I'm gonna, I'm gonna tell him I want my money back. <laughs> Ain't leaving it, man. I want my money back. <laughs> nah, nah, I'm just gonna tell him. I'm just gonna be a dick now. I mean, yeah, I gave him the uh, failure to apply already identity shit. You know, I did that failure to give him my correct identity. I did that because you know I just want to see this is one of the newer cops that I don't really know. Had time to actually get interaction with the RP with, so I figured, oh, fuck it, he doesn't know who Dicky is. He doesn't know who Dicky is. I said, Dicky is it. He really, he really thought he said warts, and I, I kept to say, I ain't have warts, but I forgot Dicky does have warts, and I didn't know this motherfucker had six, six goddamn fucking warrants out for his arrest. It's fucking crazy, bro. I don't know what, I mean. IRL, yeah, I watch his videos for at RP and Mickey doesn't know what the fuck he's doing. What the fuck, dude? What, yeah, yeah, shit, fuck, man. You know, fucking brothers, fuck you guys are fucking problems. But yeah, I just see what he's been doing on his side of the channel, motherfucker. He might be yeah. logging, so just give him a minute. Alright, I'm gonna tell this guy what he's arrested for. Yeah. Um. Yeah, let him, let him re log in and then go from there. Just, I'm gonna go ahead and get back out there. Alright. All right, man. I've already advised you of your right. Uh, you are going to be under arrest today for failure to identify nah, and obstructing come on, man. I gave an you investigation. Um, and I've also wrote you a five hundred dollar fine for littering. Five hundred dollar well. fine for littering. Come on, man. I could have picked it up and threw it away. You could have not dropped it in the first place, but you did. Well, you kept the same result in my hand. You're irritating me, you know. Well, you know, all this would have been a lot easier. If you would have, if you would have just told me who you were. Well, I mean, I got scared. You guys, I mean, 
Imagine you getting run up on by like five or six people, and then you you just get scared. You're getting all, asked all these questions, and you know I just heated a moment. I, I I'm with my brother all the time, so I said his name. I didn't mean to, and then when you said Warren, that's when I realized. Wait, I gave him the wrong name. Didn't mean to give you a wrong name. It's just you know I'm old, and you know my brain doesn't work like it used to, man. I fried it so many times throughout those years smoking weed in my life, and now I'm trying to better myself, man. Honesty goes a long way, man. I know. I told you I'm sorry. I gave you my name and I paid for the beer. So much later that the old narrator got tired of waiting and they had to hire a new one. Yeah, after... <laughs> it took a little bit, but she finally did. Well, as I told you, I'm a little old, you know, my memory, and I got scared. I just happened to say my brother's name, you know, we look alike. At least people say. Even though the ID comes back, we're away, it looks nothing like us. <laughs> and we think that we kind of don't, and we kind of do. It just. All right, I'm going to go ahead and take you down to the uh, station and get you booked and get this over with. All right, man. You can just let me out the back door, and this never happened. You didn't say no to that, so that's a yes. What'd you say? So I said you could let me out the back door and you just, just we can go on to our day, you know? Uh, I can't do that, man. Yeah, come on, man. You can just say you took me. Everything's recorded, so I can't do that. That's okay. I, I know some people that could, you know, come find you real quick, beat you up, and, you know, erase the evidence. That never happened, you know? It sucks that you'd get beat up, but I just, come on, man. This never happened. Are you trying to get another charge? Well, either that or you could just erase the footage yourself. Okay, so you're threatening a law enforcement officer, got it. No, 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 I would never threaten a law enforcement officer. I said I can get someone to get the footage taken off, but I know you're probably not going to allow it, so, you know, you're going to get hurt, and that's going to be because you're not allowing it. Okay, well, I'll tell you what. You send your little posse, whatever you want to do, but the charge is staying. All right. Don't worry. I ain't sending no posse. I don't get a posse. This is joking around, man. Yeah, well, I jokes just... like that aren't taken, taken lightly, so you're lucky you're not getting another charge. I'd fight that in court. I got a good lawyer. Okay. That's fine. No, I can't see you. Walk me out. I got to walk in myself. Oh, Jesus, it's terrible. Had it. You gotta open the door for me. There we go. Now I can see. Alright, I don't know my way around in here, so we're just gonna have to hunt for it. Alright, I'll follow you. I don't know where to go either. Ah, over here. Oh. Alright, which one do you want? I'll take this one, I guess. Alright, back up to the door. Yep. Alright. Like I said... Failure to identify and obstruction, and then you got that ticket for littering, okay? Yeah, alright, man. Damn it. Fucking What's your magic number? Uh, I don't know. It's not my job to tell you you're a cop. You figure it out. I hate when they ask that question. I don't care how old you are, how do you are, you don't ask what your magic, no, I'm not going to tell you what my fucking magic number is, because, no, that makes no fucking sense, I, I wouldn't, no, <laughs> yeah, but whatever, uh, I'm not popping around, which is weird, for the first time in a long time, but, 
Uh, usually tells me that I'm in jail. I don't know if this guy did it correctly or he just teleported me. I don't know what the hell this guy. Oh wait, I, I guess I do. But yeah, other than that, <laughs> here's another video that I just decided to record that they're the what you just saw before this. Uh, I've tried to help out the cops with you know, but you know the first time was the stop signs in the last video. And this time you know. It was, it was my fault driving around and I got a few interactions with the cops, but then I saw some civilians open up the, you know, the liquor store. I figured, yeah, it got busy. I'm going to try to take some beer and walk out. And, you know, it just, they followed me. It's it just kind of crazy, you know. And it just, it is what it is, I guess. And I tried lying, but then when they said wards, damn, dicky, you got fucking six wards, bro? Damn, crazy, bro. Yeah, and another uh, funny little interesting video. Uh, just to record, uh, I'm still working on my server, Chicago, things are going pretty well, I'll be doing some showcasing here shortly, but until next time when you see me in Scott Valley, don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe, and hopefully next time I get to get those fucking SOA pieces of pussies, because say that they're going to protect me for the cops and the cops that don't protect me, well, they're not ladies and gentlemen, don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe, and I'll see you all later. Firefly.